Good morning and welcome to Jacob Chapel, the place of victory. I'm your host, Nadesh Cern, and here's this week's edition of the Go Report. As always, we ask that you please keep those on our prayer list, bereaved families, and our sick and shut-in members in your thoughts and prayers throughout the week. Your prayers matter. Your deacon to contact this week is Deacon William Sanders. The food pantry is in constant need of donations. Please bring any non-perishable food items to the church. If you desire to be picked up for Bible study or Sunday morning worship, please call the church office at 850-574-3150. Requests for Bible study must be made by 2 p.m. on Thursday of each week and requests for Sunday morning worship service must be made by 2 p.m. on Friday of each week. If for any reason you are not riding the church van back to your pickup location, please inform the driver when they arrive. Remember, Sunday school start on time at 8.30 every Sunday. Next Sunday lesson is God blesses and recreates regardless, finding strength. Reading will come from Genesis chapter 28, 10 through 22. Come on time, prepare to learn. This Thursday at 6.45 p.m., Pastor Simmons will continue teaching from the book entitled Hurt People, Hurt People. Children and youth classes are being offered, so take some time out of your week to study and grow your faith. In observance of Veterans Day, the church office is closed tomorrow, November 12th. From now through December 31st, everyone, including members and friends, are asked to donate non-perishable food items such as canned fruits and vegetables, cereal, rice, and pasta. Through your donations, many families will be afforded a meal during the holiday season. Please bring your items to the church and place them on a pulpit or in the pantry bin. The youth ministry is asking for all youth to please turn in a copy of their report cards for recognition on Youth Sunday, December 9th. The drop box is located right outside Deacon Sanders' office and the deadline is November 25th. Right now we are headed to Bluntstown, Florida. Um, it's west of Tallahassee and this particular community um, was hit pretty hard uh, by Hurricane Michael. The need is great uh, out there. The, the need is, is tremendous. I felt in my heart that Bluntstown was one of those communities that didn't get as much attention, uh, I guess media-wise, and um, that community is in great need. And so, Lord laid it on my heart a couple of weeks ago for us to do outreach there, just to, just to see if we could give a hand up. The 300 came through uh, in a great way. Members donated money, they donated baby wipes, and. Um, diapers and water and, and clothing and just so many other uh, things that's needed out here. So I'm, I'm really looking forward to this. Our members and our friends are, are traveling out here with us and uh, we're going to minister to the need the best that we can. We haven't seen that area, you know, since the storm hit. If they need just some encouragement, I think the hugs and the handshakes um, just go a long way just to let people know that they're not forgotten. On our end, we, we may have lost power for a couple of days and we about lost our minds, right? But their resilience out here, you know, some of these people lost everything. And from a spiritual standpoint, we are called to be uh, witnesses and, and helpers beyond just our immediate area, if we as a church are blessed to do so, which Jacob Chapel is. Today at Jacob Chapel, we honor our veteran members. Marquise McMiller, United States Army, Specialist E-4, seven years currently serving. 144th Transportation Company. 
Ronald Preche, United States Army, E-5 Sergeant, two years serve, Vietnam. Herbert Hills, United States Army, E-4 Sergeant, two years serve, Vietnam. Curtis Williams, United States Army, Sergeant, two years serve. Michael Dilworth, United States Army, military policeman, 38 years served, seven tours. Sally Smith, United States Army, Staff Sergeant, 12 years served. Waleen Footman, United States Army, E-5 Sergeant, 11 years served. Terrell King, United States National Guard, E-4, six years served. Grether Brown, U.S. Army, four years served. Army National Guard, nine years served. Iraq and New Dawn. Christopher Batman, United States Marine Corps, five years served. Iraq, 2007, Afghanistan, 2009. Willie Hightower, United States Air Force, Sergeant, six years served. William Sanders, United States Air Force, Airman First Class, four years served, Vietnam. Tracy Parker, TM2 United States Navy, MPK-9 unit, 10 years served, Desert Storm First Responder. Cedric Thomas, United States Navy, Lieutenant, eight years served, Operation Desert Storm, Persian Gulf. Vinton Hobson, Navy, E-5, Beirut, Lebanon, four years served, Persian Gulf, not pictured. Rebecca Dobbins, United States Army Reserve, Sergeant First Class, 24 years served. Bill Woods, United States Army, Second Lieutenant, one year served. Reverend George Norris, United States Army, Sergeant Major, 30 years served. Korean and Vietnam, Lucius Frazier, United States Air Force, Staff Sergeant, 10 years served, Korean War. We thank you for your service, your brave actions, and your sacrifice for our country. Hey, ladies! Gentlemen! Hey, ladies! Calling all men. We have a new app. Search Go Jacob Chapel in your Android or iPhone store to download. Tons of new giving methods and updated information will be available through the app. Download today and stay connected while on the go, Jacob Chapel. Want to host the Go Report? Don't be shy. See Brother Will with the media ministry after worship service. Thank you so much for tuning in. Don't forget to register for the new giving methods. Call the church office for any questions. Again, I am your host, Nadez Stern, and until next time, we are learning, we are growing, we are strong. <laughs>